Hey guys, Tony here, and today I'm going to be reviewing um, Dietbox by Keska version 0.1.17. So, I set up a little demo for you guys, and oh wow, exactly, <laughs> it just weighs 99 score, right, for me, and but actually has 99.8, how funny, haha, <laughs> burr. Okay, but I set up a little demo for you guys, so I got a, um, a level 16 flat guard in two teams. And the new uh, clump mode is called shield. So shield mode, it um, it stays kind of in front of your cursor, or it aims um, towards your cursor, and goes kind of where your um, barrel, where your front barrel is facing. So if I go over here, then it faces over here, and this guy over here, he has body damage max, um, mind the one bullet speed, and he has uh, max movement speed. But for this, what you could do is you could have like a um an octo with like a um with like high movement speed, and then like you could have um oh um, just high movement speed. Maybe you have some body damage on the octo, but you should probably go for like a damage type where you can have high penetration with the octo and just have that spinning constantly. And then uh, like uh, kind of what Casca said, you could also have a um what was it? One of those fast guys here, I'll bring it up for you. Uh, here we go, Rocketeer, right? Yeah, you have one of these Rocketeers in the middle, and you have an Octo right here. So let's imagine I'm a Rocketeer, and that guy's an Octo. Like, we could kill so many people. And, uh, like, if you're going to use this, and if you want to go out, I'm just going to be talking a little bit about the, um, like, the updates and stuff while I die. But, um... I mean, like, this is super cool, and I'm thinking that maybe, like, you could abuse it, kind of like, uh, push bots, kind of, but they don't push you, and they stay in front of you, and, like, you could kind of use these things as shields, and if you could get, like, a million of these guys, and they're, like, constantly in front of you, and you got, like, uh, 20 of them coming at once, then maybe, like, you could have, um, like, an army just constantly in front of you. And you can't, like, die. But, like, if if you have one of these uh, shoe bots in front of you, and if you have, like, a uh, like a spike or something, then if some guy comes up to try to ram you in the face, then what you do... Oh, come on. Oh, wait, did I get him? No. Whoa. Then what you do is you put your uh, barrel towards that guy that's trying to ram you, and then your spike is going to go move over there so that it kind of counters the attack. And you can't send them out too far because they're supposed to be shields, kind of like bodyguards. So, I I still find that it's super duper cool. And I'm going to try out the thing that Casca said, maybe later. But, I mean, it's just, like, so cool. And maybe, like, uh, I wonder if we could actually bring push bots back. But it'd probably be, like, way too broken for every- for anything, but I think that these shields can be abused a lot, because it's a script, it's supposed to be abused a lot. And this could be, like, really good for four teams. It's not good for sandbox. I already kind of tried. Oh, let me just get some more health. Oh, here we go. It could be good for four teams, maybe, uh, I mean, obviously two teams. If you're not on the same team, then it's just going to kind of ram into you. Not that good. But I'm just going to be gone, and I'm just going to die. I got this little bodyguard for me, so, uh... Oh, wait. Here's the middle. Oh, yeah. The green spot right here is so cool. Thank you so much, Kazuka. It shows the uh, spawn points for everything. Let me, uh, put my sprayer on here. Oh, I didn't get it, sadly. Nor did the flat guard. But, like, I, I've never tried this, because I just got it, like, literally right now. But, like, what if you had, um, two bot Or, what if you had, like, two shield bots? Like, what would happen? And then, like, whoa, 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 whoa. When, would the uh, shield bots, like, keep on pushing each other? Grind together. No. I and mean, he's clearly died a bunch of times. I just got on uh, D up right now. But, like, just think of the amount of times you can abuse us. There's the uh, death zone. We're all the death zone. But, 
this. Oh, I got a kill. Sweet. I'll go gunner, I guess. But, like, just the uh, pure amount of times that you could just break the game with this. Like, hmm, what would keep people back? Maybe, like, you could go triplet in the middle and you could have a uh, spike as the uh, shield. Or maybe you could have, like, two spikes, huh? But no matter what, your bodyguard's always going to have to have high uh, movement speed and high uh, body damage. If you want to have it like a bodyguard like this. Maybe like, I, a lot of regen as well, since you're going to get hit a lot. Since they're taking in literally almost all the hits. Well, all the hits that they can take in. I'm just waiting to die, to be completely honest. I should go to the bottom left. Kind of glitches out a little bit. Shows a box where my thing is. I'm not too good at the game, but I'm pretty good. You can kind of call me an OG player. Some people do. Because I've been playing this game since, like, 2018. Whoa. Hey there, buddy. Dang. Whoa. Oh, you smart. Oh, you're not that smart. You're not that good of an overseer. Overlord. Whatever. Hey, bro, let me save your life. There you go. You're welcome. Oh, yeah. You just kind of see how this guy with all the body damage kind of saved me from the Overlord, though? That's pretty cool. I'm looking to die. It's fine. I could go right into Annihilator. Also, if you do have a spike with um, a bunch of uh, body damage and shield stuff, like... Whoa, you literally, and I mean literally, cannot, I mean, you can die from rammers, but like, if you are fast enough, and if I'll practice with it, and if you have a spike in front of you, like, an annihilator, just trying to ram into you, no chance. And if you have enough of these guys, then, oof, that'd be pretty freaking amazing. Oh, come on. I didn't get... He got it? Why didn't must he get it? Why? Oh, dude. What if you had, like, a sprayer? And then you had, like, a, uh... Uh, spike. That'd be cool. I mean, I'm just keep on... I'm keeping on doing reviews of all these mods. Because they're so cool. And I really support Kazka, so thank you, Kaz. I've been, uh, following, I mean, yeah, kind of following for the past while. That guy sucks. I don't know if I should go too far in. I want to go past that line. I mean, I'm pretty good. Or all these other guys suck. <laughs> I'm trying to die out here, and I keep on getting kills, but... I can't go past that line. Oh, oh, you trying to ram into me, huh? Ooh, you so cool? No, you're not so cool, huh? You see how that guy saved my life right there? GG. Thank you, shield bot. Okay, I should probably back away. Actually, I'm trying to die, but... I just gave you... How am I almost level 45 already? But I just gave you guys an example of the shield bot saving my life. Like... Thanks, Mr. She Tony Scalwhite T. Well, anyways, that is going to be the end of my review. So, thank you guys for watching. This has been Tony Scalwhite T with another review from Kazkuz 0.1.17. If, if you like these reviews, then leave a comment, maybe like, and uh, maybe I'll learn how to edit, but I do these videos for free. So thank you guys for watching. This has been Tony Scale YT with another episode of reviews. And I will see you guys later. Peace.